25 years ago, I was doing pharmacy, right? I was doing pharmacy at Sydney University, and I was in the lab, okay, and we were making drugs. Um, <laughs> we used to call it cooking class. <laughs> we were making suppositories in particular. And my mate, he was like putting all the medication in the mould, he just flattened it all down. And he looked up at me and he said, this is the most fun part of the course. And I was like, fuck it, I'm out of here. See you, mate. <laughs> if that's as good as it gets, that is not exciting enough for me. And I left and I started doing stand-up comedy 25 years ago. And this is how my career's gone. I was sort of like, I started here. I was pretty good when I started, and, and then, and then I, and this is how it went. I just, I started, and then I just sort of improved, just very slowly, nothing too exciting. If you've seen me over the years, you'll know it's true. <laughs> oh yeah, this show is just slightly better than last year. I mean, that's how it goes. And then I got the gold Logie, and then it went like that. <laughs> that's where I am now, here with you. <laughs> and you know what I've got to show for it? After 25 years, I've got like a house in Romsey in the country, an hour out of town. I've got like a wife, two kids, a couple of chooks, two Volvos. <laughs> I've got the lifestyle of a fucking pharmacist. <laughs> it's taken me 25 years to get to where I would have been anyway. <laughs> I even look like a pharmacist. <laughs> you can imagine me in the shop giving out reasonable advice. Just standing up the back going, oh yeah, with the antibiotics. <laughs> Even if you feel better, you have to finish the course, okay? <laughs> yeah, yeah, even if you feel better, yeah, you've got to finish the course. I've got to go back to making some suppositories. <laughs> which is the most fun part of my day. 